news. An eight-letter word. The clue is, they're just plain people. It's the crossword game you've played all your life, but never quite like this. And here's your host, Cut Floyd. Oh, thanks, everybody. Thank you, Charlie Tuna, and welcome to the television version of everyone's favorite game. Home viewer word, Betty. Oh, please, Parfenook. Is that right, Parfenook? From Watertown, Massachusetts. I hope we got your last name right, Betty, but anyway, we have a T-shirt for you. Today, the jackpot stands at $5,000. That thing was knocked off yesterday, so it's down to five or up to five, however you want to look at it. Uh, Charlie has our first two players. Charlie? She's a big spinner. He's an associate pastor. Originally from West Palm Beach, Florida, Alza Lee Colbert. And originally from Olympia, Washington, Eric Ogren. All right, nice to have you both here. Azir, how do you say your last name or your first name? Alzali. Alzali. How are you, Alzali? Fine, thank you. And yeah. well, in Florida, it's Alzali Colbert, and in Hollywood, it's Alzali Colbert. <laughs> oh, I see. Well, yes, it's changed a little here. Tell me yes. about yourself, huh? Well, I right now I'm unemployed, but I will be a big spinner. I'm going to the big spin in Sacramento. Oh, are you for the lottery? Uh, yes. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's great. Yes. Now, will you get to I do that? I blew my card note, note of $200 and bought me 200 scratch tickets, and I found a spin ticket. And so now you get to spin. You get to spin. Yes. Oh, so you can. You're going to at least make ten thousand, aren't you? Yes, guaranteed ten thousand. Guaranteed. And but maybe. I hope I make a million. And maybe a million. Yes, I hope. I wish. And maybe even double that. <laughs> yes. Or maybe hit the grand slam and quadruple it or something. <laughs> can I go with you? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> nice to have you. Good luck to you. Thank Albert. you. Yeah. How you doing, Eric? Good, Chuck. Tell me about yourself. I'm an associate pastor in Hawthorne. I'm 30 years old. Have a lovely wife, Patsy, and I have the honor of viewing your only film ever made. 1978 movie. Don't hold it against me, okay? Produced and directed by Stan Riley. I think so, Called yeah. the, prize. the prize. Not Boy, the real prize. Weren't you a skier? Paul Newman was. <laughs> it was the worst movie. Oh. It was awful. And oddly enough, it's not the only one. It should have been. Oh, I couldn't but find any other Someone other. lost their mind and hired me to do another one. <laughs> yeah. Return of the prize. Yeah. Huh? Who won the toss backstage? I did. All right, Alzali. We're going to play Scrabble till somebody gets three words right. That player goes on to our Scrabble sprint. And a chance of the bonus sprint, possible $5,000. Take a look at the board as we set up for the first game. We're building on the letter O. Eight letters in the word. The clue is, it's another word for a breast. When you think you know the word, hit your buzzer. Don't forget the pink and blue bonus squares. They're worth money. It's another word for a breast. Nobody wants to go over this one. I love it. Everybody's saying, not me. I'm not doing it. Not me either. I'm not going to do it. I'll take a seven and a five. We woke up our sound man, Alzali. Oh. Enter an M. I'll take the M. It's another word for a breast. Not quite. I'll take the N. Very I'll take clever the six. Clue. And the three. E or an R. I'll take the R. I'll take the E. It's another word for a breast. The four. And the nine. D or an F? I'll take the D. Five hundred dollars. It's another word for a breast. Informed. That's exactly right. Have to hit the buzzer. Right? Hit it. Now you got it. Very nicely done. So how are we going to get to Sacramento? They, fly me, they will fly me to Sacramento. Are uh, you and a friend or just you? Just me. Mm. Yes. I have to pay my own way. Yes, pay One, way. two, three, four, five hundred. Good for you. Mm. All right, Eric. Building on the letter M and informed seven letters in the word. The clue is some kids got together and rolled him. Some kids got together and rolled it. Let's take a five. And rolled him. Rolled him? Him. And a Seven for the fun of it. Some kids rolled him. Some kids got together. Got together and rolled him. Well, we'll get it all together. Give me an N, please. And I'll take the M. Stop it. Azalee. 
elderly. I'll, I'll take the six and the nine. N or a W? I'll take the W. Some kids got together and rolled him. I'll take the N. It's worth $500. Some kids got together and rolled him, elderly. Can't do Don't it see right it? Now. No. Well, that happens. I'll take the three. Just keeping that sound man busy, aren't you? <laughs> and, the, and the eight. L and an O. I'll take the O. That's worth $500. Some kids got together and rolled him. No, man. No. Do you want to try this for $500, Eric? Yes, I do. There's no money. Snowmen. That's exactly right. Snowmen, yes. Yeah. Everybody's got money. Oh, I want money. Hey. Singular or plural? Take you that. You One, bet. two, three, cuatro, cinco. You bet. Yeah. Everybody's got 500. Eight Building six. on the letter S in snowman or snowman. Eight letter. What? Speed word already? Okay, out of time. Going to play this one in speed word. Hands on your buzzers. Don't answer till I say go. We'll put the letters in place one at a time. Can't give you the last letter. Building on the letter S in snowman. Eight letters in the word. The clue is he plays for the Dodgers. He plays for the Dodgers. Ready? Go. Organist. That's exactly right. Five hundred dollars too. I'll keep track and pay you. Building on the letter A in organist, six letters in the word. The clue is they sometimes cause pillow talk. Ready? Go. They sometimes cause pillow talk. Green. Like, yes. Another 500. Boy. Before I say goodbye to anybody, I'm going to be handing out a ton of money here. Building on the letter R in dreams, eight letters in the word. It's anybody's game. The clue is it's a landmark decision. It's a landmark decision. Ready? Go. It's a landmark decision. Eric, boundary. That's exactly right. Another 500. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Oh. Alzali, Alzali could care less. She's going to go pick up her million in Sacramento. She doesn't care. She's having a good time. And you want another 500? Yes. One, two, three, four, five. You got a thousand from us, kid. Oh, thanks for coming again. Really enjoyed having you. It's nice to meet you, too. Nice to meet you. Eric's got another thousand or five. One, two, three, four, five. Gives you two thousand. Two thousand? Is that right? Another five. One, two, three, four. Five, that gives you two thousand. Yeah, there you go. We're gonna play Scrabble Spring. We'll be back. Wonderful. At Ben Gay, we wondered if the millions who use our original product for minor arthritis pain would also accept Ben Gay warming ice, our cool gel. Well, in just one year, it became the fastest growing product of its kind, Ben Gay Warming Ice. This is a warning to household germs. You can't hide from Lysol brand disinfectant. It's hospital type, the best kind you can buy. So germs, don't say you haven't been warned. In home after home, people are throwing out cleaners they don't need, because all they need is Lysol Direct. Direct cleans everything without rinsing, so people are making room for one cleaner that cleans everything, Lysol Direct. A lot of people think I work for so many ball clubs because I had a bad temper or something. Actually, once you get to know me, I'm really a pussycat. If you don't believe that, wait till you hear this. Dryer's Grand Light is as good as regular ice cream, even though it's lower in calories and 93% fat-free. Plus, it's all natural. And it tastes great. Take it from Mr. Nice Guy. Stone Age dogs got a meaty teeth cleaning bone every day. But over time, bones lost the meat. Not meaty bone dog biscuits. They're baked with real beef for a better tasting bone. Meaty bone brings meat back to the bone. And now, back to Scrabble and Chuck Woolery. All right, 
Thanks. Eric uh, Ogren has $2,000. He's going to establish a time. The winner of the next crossword is going to try to beat that time. Mind you, hit your plunger. That's what stops the clock. And no stoppers. All the letters are good. Uh, okay. -do. First word, five letters. A model Ford. A model Ford. Ready? Ready. Go. Y. T. T. A model Ford. Betty. Yes. Yeah! Yeah, I didn't think so. Second word, seven letters. There are no bed of roses. There are no bed of roses. Ready? Ready. Go. L. A. Z. There are no bed of roses. Azaleas. Yes. Or azaleas. That's perfect. Third word, six, uh, third word, eight letters. It contains a lot of brass. It contains a lot of brass. Ready? Ready. Go. T. P. N. It contains a lot of brass. A. N. G. It contains Pentagon. Yeah. Oh. The last word has nine letters. They're one track. They're one track. Ready? Ready. Go. R. A. I. They're one track. O. L. M. They're one track. Monorail. Yes, 30.5. That one, actually, I thought you might get off the clue. I got so, well, all the rest of them, you did great. The next one, I don't know. How tall are you, anyway? Yeah. Six five. That's right. Six got two. You got to be at least three or four inches taller than I am. Great day. All right. Uh, Eric O'Grin has three th or thirty point five. That's the time to beat. We'll find out if somebody can do it right after this. There you got great curves. Great curves deserve eighteen hour. Playtex eighteen hour bra supports full figures more beautifully. Comfortably. Great curves deserve. The 18 hour bra. From Playtex, the fit that makes the fashion. Grandpa, hmm. why is orange just orange? Because it comes from oranges. Oranges are orange, aren't they? But Grandpa, if oranges were blue, would they still call it orange juice? Orange juice. It's got the vitamins, minerals, and taste that make you feel so good. Blue orange juice? Nah. 100% pure Florida quality orange juice. It makes you feel so good. I'm Saul Thessman, president of Queen City Home Healthcare. I'd like to tell you about a medical product that is very effective and may be at no cost to you. This is the lift and recline chair. It is being used by thousands of people who suffer from severe arthritis as a form of treatment in their homes. Best of all, if you qualify, you could receive this chair at no cost. Here's how. You must have a qualifying condition, such as severe arthritis or other diseases, which make the chair a medically necessary treatment. You must be enrolled in Medicare Part B and have a Medicare co-insurance policy, which covers the Medicare deductible and co-payment for this type of equipment. Many people suffer from arthritis and cannot get up from a seated position. This chair will give them the freedom to get around and help them avoid falls and injuries. So if you're a Medicare recipient, and meet the previous conditions, you can get this lift chair delivered to your door at no cost. Call now, 1-800-950-9900. Queen City is commended by the Arthritis Foundation. A cheese riddle. Excuse me, Giorgio. What do you get when you add mozzarella to an ordinary tomato? <laughs> Something to sing about. That's right. Cheese makes it taste better. So don't forget the cheese. Eric Holdren is our champion, and we have two new players. Got it? She's a travel consultant. He's an automation supervisor. Originally from Uruguay, South America, Crystal Shaw. And originally from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico, Jimmy Samaniego. All right, nice to have you both here. How are you, Crystal? <laughs> Tell me about yourself, Crystal. Well, I'm a travel consultant from Beverly Hills. I'm wife and the proud mother of a beautiful boy named Taylor. Hi, Taylor. How old is Taylor? He'll be two in July. Oh, well, good. Nice to have you here, Crystal. Thank you. Good luck to you. And, Jimmy, tell me about yourself. Uh, Chuck, I'm originally from New Mexico, where my grandparents still reside. Truth or consequences. Now, they went through a whole thing to name that truth or consequences. Yes, they, they did. They went around the country and said, who would like to have their town named this? <laughs> and your town picked it. Yes. What'd they get for it? I have no idea, Chuck. Oh, well. <laughs> 
Tell me more about you. Um, I have my other relatives live on the East Coast, and I came here to say hi to my cousin Tootie. And I also love to water ski, and I love to travel. Great. Nice to have you both here. Who won Thank the toss? You. I did. Let's go to the board. Building on the letter T, nine letters in the word. The clue is some wives greet their suspicious husbands with a flimsy one. Okay, I'll take the one and the three. I'll take that S. Crystal? I guess that means good for me. Uh, without giving away my age, I'd like to take a two and a five. Oh, you can only say that five's not going to drop in because oh, you I'm already sorry. have a letter to work with, okay? O oh, and I'm, I. I'm only two. I'll take the O. And I'll have to place the I. Some wives greet their suspicious husbands with a flimsy one. I don't know it, so okay, now let's take that five. The five will go in, and, uh, and you can pick another letter. a four. H and a G. Uh, let's try the G. And the H, please. Some wives greet their suspicious husbands with a flimsy one. Oh, I'm going to go for some money. Two uh, stoppers still out. Let's, let's try the 11 and the 10. G or an H? The G, please. Some wives greet their husbands, suspicious husbands, with a flimsy one. Nightgown. That's right. <laughs> Jimmy, we're building on the letter O in nightgown. Six letters in the word. The clue is some of them have dirty rings around them. Okay, Chuck, I will take the one <clears throat> and the seven. K and a Y. I'll take the Y. Stop it. Crystal. Uh, let's try the eight. K and an R. Uh, let's try that R. Some of them have dirty rings around them. And the K. He picked two stoppers and passed you one. It's back to you, Jimmy. Only one stopper left. All right, great. I pick the two and the four. E or a B? Give me the E, please, Chuck. $500. Some of them have dirty rings around them. I don't see it. I have to place that B. Okay, I'll take the five and the three. R and an X. I'll take the R. No, you can't do it that way. Crystal, you know what it is? Boxer. That's right, it's boxers. Got a little ring around them. Jimmy, we're going to stay with you. You got to get this one, though. Building on the letter R and boxers, nine letters in the word. The clue is. Some farmers are looking for one in a haystack. Some farmers. Okay. Two chances two. of $1,000. And the seven. H and an F. Place H. And the F. Some farmers are looking for one in a haystack. Okay, take the three. And the eight, please. L and a P. The L, please. It's all yours, Crystal. Well, I know it, and I really want some money, so I'm going to place an 11. A B and a P. Place the P, please. Pitchfork. Boy, wouldn't you know you'd hit that stopper. Bad guy. Well, you had a couple of chances, but just couldn't pull it off. Jimmy, uh, no money, but we do have a, a golf driver. A golf driver, like a golf club driver. I want to see this. Let's take a look. Jimmy, for you, Pin Seekers Fireball Graphite Driver with graphite shafts, superior design, quality, and performance. Innovatively engineered for the discriminating golfer. Furnished by Pin Seeker. That is a very good club. I use those clubs. I, honestly, I didn't even know they were as we had them on the show. That's, that's the club I use. Yeah, it's a nice club. All right. Well, I hope you enjoy that, Jimmy. It'll straighten you. your drive out and get rid of that hook or slang or, or slice, whatever you do. Anyway, Crystal, daggone it. You had two chances to make money and couldn't do it. Well, I'm here. <laughs> $500 for you, and you get a chance at uh, 1000 right after this. So uh, we'll come back and watch it. Thank you. If you're allergic to things, 
The difference in Kleenex tissue is reassuring. Kleenex has added nothing extra. It's just pure Kleenex tissue. Pure and simple. Kleenex says bless you. This trouble crew has a plan. And they begin by digging into those two scoops. In every Kellogg's pack. Two scoops. We'll keep them coming back to those two scoops. The pump juicy raisins in Kellogg's Raisin Bran. Hooked up and in command. They're working now, but they're thinking how they love two scoops. And lots of wholesome brands. Two scoops. They're turning back again for two scoops. The pump juicy raisins in Kellogg's. If we could make you a salad with dehydrated lettuce or fresh lettuce, which would you prefer? Dehydrated tomatoes or fresh, ripe tomatoes, which would you prefer? The leading ranch dressing made with dehydrated buttermilk or new rancher's choice from Kraft made with fresh buttermilk, which would you prefer? New rancher's choice from Kraft, the one real choice. This little mousie has a Kraft single slice made from five ounces of milk. But this mousie has an imitation slice that's mostly oil and water. That's why Kraft singles taste better. Milk makes them better. What he did, he said he did for love. Robert Young, Francis Reed, Eddie Alpert, and Michael learned to discover if it was mercy or murder Friday. Back to Scrabble and Chuck Woolery. Eric Ogren, $2,000, 30 points, five is the time to beat. And Crystal Shaw has 500. She's going to try to beat that time. Play the same four words. I'm going to remind you to hit your plunger. That's what stops the clock. There are no stoppers in any of these words. All the letters are good. Now you're on your own. Okay? Good luck. First word, five letters. A model Ford. Ready? Ready. Go. Why? T. B. A model Ford. T. Betty. Yes. The second word has seven letters. There are no bed of roses. There are no bed of roses. Ready? Ready. Go. E. A. S. There are no bed of roses. A. Azalea. Yes. The third word has eight letters. It contains a lot of brass. It contains a lot of brass. Ready? Ready. Go. T. Orchestra. No. Uh, obviously, you see that that doesn't work. Ten second penalty. Let's continue. Oh. It contains a lot of brass. It contains a lot of brass. Ready? Ready. Go. N. P. N. It contains a lot of brass. G. Uh, you were thinking of the wrong terms. You were thinking more of the Pentagon. Oh. Okay. Congratulations, Eric. You did it. He had a little trouble with monorail. Actually, he went through azaleas pretty fast. Uh, Betty, everybody took to the end. Pentagon was a little tough. And the last one was monorail with one track. And you might have even got that off the clue. Yeah, you wouldn't have? Well, he didn't either, so. <laughs> Oh, well, it worked out. Uh, Crystal, you, you've got 500 in our thanks. Thanks for playing the game. Huh? Thank really you. Good, really good. Uh, Eric, 2,000 bucks. Going to come back and try for 5,000. We'll do that right after this. 3,000, excuse me. We'll be back to you. If you want traffic stopping lips, go with Maybelline Moisture Whip Lipstick. A beautiful, shiny, wet color. Moisture Whip. Just put it on. Take off. Smart. Beautiful. Maybelline. These very special meats are lean and low in calories. But like everything we make, they're very big on taste. There's a name for food this good. Hormel. At the first sign of your allergy symptoms, help prevent a full-blown allergy attack. Take Alarac. And don't let your allergies close in on you. 
If you live in Los Angeles or you're planning to visit the L.A. area and you would like to become a contestant on Scrabble, call area code 213-284-8644. And now, back to Chuck Woolery and today's winner. All right, thank you, Charlie. Eric Ogren has $3,000. Uh, he's going to try for five. Where is your church, Eric? Hawthorne. What kind is it? It's uh, Deller Assembly of God is the name of the church. Oh, great. Oh, good. Have you been there a long time? Four years and four months. That's a pretty long time. You've been doing that since you were 26? Yeah, there. I was in Oregon for five years before that on staff of two churches. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Well, let's see if you can take, uh, what, $5,000 home with you. Great. Two words under five seconds. Six letters for the first one. They can come back to haunt you. They can come back to haunt you. They can come back to haunt you. Ready? Ready. Go. C. E. Echoes. You got it. 5.8. Yeah, the keyword was comeback. Seven letters. An overcoat. An, An overcoat. overcoat. Ready? Ready. Go. R. Q. An overcoat. L. Lacquer. You've got it. I never thought you'd get it. Very nicely done. I thought there was no way that you were ever going to get that out of overcoat. Because I guess the Q helped a little bit in the L. But good night. I mean, there was just there was just nothing going on there. And uh, you came up with it. That's great. The second time it's happened this week. Somebody nailed one of those babies down. All right. Brings you up to eight thousand yeah, dollars. I'm sure you can it. use that. Yeah. All right. All right. We have about ten seconds left. That's just enough time to say thank you for joining us today. Uh, we had a good time with you. Hope you had a good time with us. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye, everybody. Come on down here. Okay. Starring Chuck Woolery is produced in association with Exposure Unlimited. This program is based on the Scrabble brand crossword game. This is Charlie Tuna speaking. Stick around for more game show fun than you ever thought possible. Test your powers next on Classic Concentration. Then, fasten your seatbelts and take a wild ride round and round with everyone's favorite Wheel of Fortune, followed by the howls, scrawls, and scratches on the fast and funny Win, Lose, or Draw, only on NBC. Scrabble is a red...